You can use the converse of the Pythagorean theorem to determine whether a triangle is a right triangle. The converse of the Pythagorean theorem. Theorem 8-2, it states, if the sum of the squares of the lengths of two sides of a triangle is equal to the square of the length of the third side, then the triangle is a right triangle. So if, in the diagram, a squared plus b squared equals c squared, then triangle ABC is a right triangle. Problem four, identifying a right triangle. A triangle has side lengths 85, 84, and 13. Is the triangle a right triangle? Explain. We'll use the Pythagorean theorem to test these lengths. We'll substitute 13 for A, 84 for B, and reserve C for the longest side length, 85, because if this is indeed a right triangle, a C will stand in for the hypotenuse, which is the longest side length. Is it true that 169 plus 7056 equals 7225? Sure enough, so yes, the triangle is a right triangle because 13 squared plus 84 squared equals 85 squared. Your turn, part A. A triangle has side lengths 16, 48, and 50. Is the triangle a right triangle? Explain. In part B, a reasoning item, once you know which length represents the hypotenuse, does it matter which length you substitute for A and which length you substitute for B? Explain.